this is the continuation of the previous video so actually in the previous video i created the one uh, one method so details method or details function so on that method uh, i am returning the value to the details function so now actually in this program the code is so big so that purpose i want to split this data into two parts so so this is my html file now i want to put the this data this script javascript into the external file so so for that purpose i am creating the i created the one external js file my js file name is ramcon.js save as ramcon. use the javascript dot js okay so after that after that copy the your script code okay copy the within the script tags uh, copy that code and put in the external js file and after that within the script okay include that file src equals to src equals to ram ram js so r a m capital r a m c o n c o n dot j s so our file is resides in this ram khan dot j s file resides in our home directory okay file so observe the our home directory our home directory is a j s and also our ram khan dot j s file also is exist on the a j s folder so no need to so that purpose i am simply including that the file now save the documents and the run once okay like this way we are using the external j s files so like this way we are splitting the code our javascript code and put in the external j s files and one more thing is there so observe the output of this program so the both documents and the documents actually here in the here i have the some name and the locations so that name and the location are printed in the linked uh, sorry unordered list so how this program is written so first of all so within the using the script src we are including the our javascript cdn after that our ng after that give ng app equals to s app ng control equals to names control our app name is s app and control is names control using that ng hyphen repeat method sorry ng hyphen repeat Direct to. I am repeating the uh, elements of in the array. Okay, x in the names, x dot name, concatenated with comma, x dot country list. So after that, the script to SRC equals to ram ram dot js. What is the ram ram dot js? So Angular, I am here. I am not take the any variable here. So simply this one is our app name is S app. Angular dot module S app. Dot controller names controller. This is our names controller. After that function, our our parameter is dollar scope dollar scope dot names. So here names is the two dimensional array name colon Venkat country Norway name colon Suman country Sweden name Lakshman country Denmark. So like this is our array. Okay. So now these these elements are in our controller okay now these array elements are printed on the our html page using the controller methods using the controllers okay scope dot names here names your uh, name, names are your our parameters 
So names are repeated here. So if you have any doubt about the NGFM repeat method, please watch my previous videos.